Today we are going to the Georgia Renaissance Fair. I am a very busy lady right now. I'm prepping for Momocon and I have a bunch of freelance work that I'm doing as well as a bunch of other life stuff going on so I didn't get a chance to do something specific for a video this week so instead we're just gonna go with me to the Renaissance Fair. I've been to this Renaissance Fair multiple times now and it's just like a fun day trip. So let's go see what they got this year. I got to pet a bird and it was really chill. This little cockatoo, super sweet. I love birds. And look at how sweet she is. He is, whatever. Just sat there and loved to be pet. And then I got to hold a goose, <laughs> which was also cool and weird and fun. <laughs> After meeting the goose, we met up with my friend Jalisa and her husband and my brother. <laughs> just, just be really cool. Yeah. It's a video. It's a video. Brought my camera. Nice one, but the battery's dead. Yeah. Okay. Hi. It's really nice to meet you. <laughs> Honestly, most of this video is just me futzing around and being an idiot with Jaleesa, so I hope you enjoy that. We walked around a bit and then we heard this really cool guy playing a cool instrument. Should Bruno not buy one of these? <laughs> Bruno, you would look so good in this. You should get it. Would I look terrible in that? No! <laughs> I didn't buy much this year because, to be honest, we spent most of our money on vet bills. <laughs> but I did get this cute little fairy ear cuff, which I thought was really adorable. We also got to see some really cool costumes and hat designs and just people showing off their creativity, which is always so fun. This gargoyle guy is always there, and he's like the staple of the Ren Fair. He is so cool. <laughs>
just continued going into all the little fun shops and stuff, looking at cool LARPing weapons, and just having a good old time. And then eventually we came across a spooky haunted house. Oh, spooky! I want to mention that Jaleesa and I are active card carrying members of Super Weenie Hut Juniors. So, yes, we are gigantic babies. After that traumatizing experience, we went to my favorite shop, an area full of little guys. This is where I got the little guys that are on my husband and my shoulders. <laughs> Oh, he looks a little sad. I hate E.T. He's the worst. Look at cute little guys. Look at them, so cute. This place is really cool because the person who started it worked, I think, for like Jim Henson and did a lot of other puppets and figurines and stuff in the 80s and 90s and these are just a few examples of all of the things he's done which I think is really cool and then now he runs this little booth where he sells a bunch of little guys <laughs> I came back here specifically because they sell these little leather saddles that sit on your shoulder so that the little guys sit better on you. And so I went to go get one. They're only 15 bucks and the lady was really nice. She installed my little dude on it and then attached it to my body. That's about it for this video. I know it was kind of different than my usual stuff. Let me know if you liked it and if you want to see more like videos where I just kind of go do stuff. I don't know. I guess this is like a vlog. I don't know. Let me know down below. And I hope you have a marvelous day. Okay, goodbye.